In this video, we are going to unpack 11 packages from the website vova.com. If you're interested, keep watching. The reason I decided to make this video is because I received so many comments from you. Have you ever tried purchasing from this website? So I decided to give it a try. Uh, so I ordered 12 items and they all came in 11 separate packages. I placed the order in January and received it at the end of March. And one item was actually right in my mailbox. So let's unpack them together. Let's see what we have here. Oh, this is stars that will glow in the dark. Mm -hmm. Also, we have foil. Okay, they're connected with a stapler with many different patterns. One more glow in the dark. Those are half moons. I'm really wondering why did they send them in a separate packages, which arrived, by the way, in a different time. Okay, one more glow in the dark hexagons. Now this is something cool. This is like dark gray, almost black chrome powder. I really wonder if it does work like the chrome powder should. Black matte foil. Another foil which is like seashell style. Another glow in the dark. Why did they really send them all separate? I mean, isn't it more expensive? Like they were advertised like the whole set. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, now this is something I hoped was will be a bit bigger. So these are like fancy different shape spatulas to mix gels, glitters and other beautiful things. You see, they're kind of small. This is the size of my palm. But, oh well, I guess that's enough, you know, because we're going to mix only small things with them. And this is the silk wrap. I was hoping it will be like those the Brazilian nail technicians use, but no, this is just a regular roll of the silk wrap. And we have, oh, this was right in my mailbox, this tiny seashells. I never actually received a mail like that. And this is also, I hoped for kind of a different size. I thought I can install them on the nail, like put some dry flowers in them, cure in the gel, and it will be a beautiful design on my nail, but I guess it will work only for some crazy fantasy competition. So now let's try these products. The first one that came in was this one with seashells and those are just small seashells and yes, I think you can find similar ones at the beach, but that's only if you live by the beach. And oh, those are pretty cool. And what is that? That's like a stone which doesn't look like something I would like to install in the nails. But those are like pretty. I will definitely be using them for some see summer style design. These are four different shapes of accessories. So we have hearts, half moons, hectagons and stars and they're pretty thin. I mean, I think they will work even under the top coat. And the most exciting part is that they glow in the dark. So this is how they look with the lights on and this is how they glow with the lights off. But this beautiful glow is only when they're like in the jar. So you see when we take the small particles, they're thinner. They still glow, but not as intense. But still, I think this is kind of cool for creating designs. Now let's try dark gray chrome powder. I have a black tip, so I will apply a top coat. This is a no white top coat, so you need to know how your top coat and your lamp works. So for this one, I know it usually takes about 15 to 20 seconds and then I can apply the chrome powder. So now I cure it, take the tip and we really need just a little bit of this powder. 
just apply it and start all right well it does look pretty cool it is really metallic one and it does have this mirror look hmm. okay so now well I didn't take any brush so let me do this just with my finger luckily I'm wearing gloves and yeah well it is a cool black like dark gray chrome color it definitely looks the best with a black background but something tells me that dark brown or dark gray might also look nice so now we only need to seal it with a top coat i usually use old top coat um, for sealing chrome powders especially when i'm just working on the tips not on the clients and then fully cure for one minute this is how it looks after curing you can even see me hi here in the reflection so yes i definitely like this powder and i will be using it let's try seashell foil and usually what i do i just take it from the jar and then i just cut the part depending on how many nails do i need well for now we're just testing so let's just take this small piece and then i put it back well this piece is pretty long so we can afford doing this because you know i don't like when then foil is all full of holes and empty parts so we'll just put it away and then i have this tip with the gray background and also i will use foil gel by Jellico. this is special gel for transferring foil the consistency is thick which is really nice so then what we do we cure for 30 seconds in led let's transfer it so i don't think i want to do it fully let's Ooh, it's sticky man and all right it's beautiful and you know this design is abstract so i think it's fine that this part right here was not fully transferred i even think that we can do this oh yeah it's still fine and here we have a small piece missing we can always add it well, luckily yeah it's not kind of pattern that's you know not allowed to be a little crazy and abstract so this foil is actually kind of thick so it will be challenging to fully transfer it on the nail but if you want to transfer some parts and then decorate them i think it will look kind of cool now let's try another one from this bundle so those are different you see when you look on the back they're silver not white and they're much thinner so this kind of foil works a bit differently and also they have hollow parts in it exactly how i want it so oh and you you definitely need to have sharper scissors for cutting it so let's try this again actually you might not really need a foil gel i think it will transfer even on the sticky layer but let's just try it if you're using foil gel i mean it will definitely transfer much easier because it's very sticky it's cured and let's transfer this one. Oh yeah it feels so thin wow yes yeah, so this one definitely works for transferring it fully because it's super thin and it doesn't really break and uh, i really enjoy this hollow and chrome they have on the background so i definitely like these foils better and you see they have kind of crazy psychedelic patterns here well this one with pearls is fine and they have more like seashell looks and oh check this one out i like the colors this one is really kind of crazy wow and no the image is not blurry it's like the design itself and this one oh okay so that's the same ones just from the other side so yeah i think i like this foils really because i was looking for something like that for a while and i'm going to use this in my design as well now we have black matte foil 
well it's not really matte but it's black and I think it doesn't really make sense to transfer the full color because there are just easier ways to achieve that so let's do something abstract so I have neon background and I already cut a piece of it now let's make a little crumples because I want you know to have this grunge abstract particles look on it and let's start transferring so I have gel polish with a sticky layer I didn't apply anything on it and ooh, it does look pretty easy if we leave it like that then it can be an Easter design but if we keep going it will be um, something more abstract so then you can add a line right here or some hand painted elements or just leave it like that like an abstract design now let's try it on the green background and I think you can reuse this piece as many times as you want because it will still transfer the small particles it will be actually easier when it's not new when it's like used but eventually it will stop working but I mean for now it does work so yeah this transfer foil is definitely good and can be used for different abstract and other styles of designs these are three cute spatulas one is like a knife another one is more like a needle and the third one is spoon so whenever you need to mix something gel glitter something together or in between I think this spoon will work just great you know because sometimes you just need to mix the colors together or you want the glitter to go on top and yes it definitely does work so next time I will be using this cute spoon you will be asking Anastasia where did you get one so now you know and the last item is this silk wrap in a roll so this is the regular silk we use for fixing broken nails even for extensions and honestly I think silk is more comfortable when it comes in the pieces of the nail shapes but this one is definitely will I mean there's a lot in the roll so you have like silk for the rest of your career for sure and I will probably trying this a bit later so that was my unpacking from the website vova.com I have to admit all items were very cheap and probably it was worth waiting for the whole two months let me guys what do you think have you ever tried purchasing from this website and what are your favorite online websites for nail shopping thank you so much for watching if this is your first time here on my channel consider subscribing as I post new tutorials and reviews just like this one every week see you in my next one bye